What's being called one of the worst examples of ethnic cleansing in recent decades, forcing the exodus of more than 100,000 ethnic Armenians from their homes. ABC's Patrick Revel has been following those developments, and he joins us now from London with that side of the story. Good morning, Patrick. Good morning, Gio. Yeah, this can only be described as large-scale ethnic cleansing. Over 100,000 ethnic Armenians have now fled the disputed enclave of Nagorno-Karabakh. That means virtually the enclave's entire population has now left, abandoning their homes after Azerbaijan, backed by Turkey, recaptured the region with a military offensive last week. The families are taking only what they can hold. They've been streaming into Armenia. Old people, young children, traveling often exposed to the weather. This is a region that's sandwiched between Turkey and Russia, and the enclave has been at the center of a bloody conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan for decades. It's internationally recognized as part of Azerbaijan, but Armenians have lived there for centuries. Hundreds of thousands of Azerbaijanis were also driven out in the 1990s. Now, once the Armenians have left, Azerbaijani forces are likely to move in next week and celebrate their victory. The Biden administration has expressed concern this last week, dispatching the USAID administrator Samantha Power to the region. And this morning, a UN mission has arrived to assess humanitarian needs. But this takes its place among the worst examples of ethnic cleansing in recent years. And so far, the world has done little more than shrug. Gio. Uh, important that you are bringing attention to it, Patrick, so that more people are aware of what's happening there. Patrick, thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.